Tranmere are one of League Two's form sides. Three straight festive wins has banished relegation fears. Home form has been the bedrock. They've won the last four at Prenton Park. Notts County are back on track after two big home wins. The fifth place Magpies compiled an aggregate score of 8 0 in those wins over Doncaster and Morecambe. The away form is not their forte. They've lost the last four on their travels. McAleer and Norris come in for Rovers. County are unchanged. The county 1 2 1 at home in the reverse fixture. That's it, not one here since 2011. Tranmere have been terrific. Terrific rather of late under Nigel Atkins. And here they go with the first effort, and it's an absolute belter. Kieran Morris. Stunning. Five minutes in, Tramia hit the front. And this is now his uh, most productive ever season in the Football League, Kieran Morris. Seventh league goal of the campaign. It's a scorcher. Tramia one, Notts County nil. Seven wins from 12 home games this season for Tranmere Rovers. Traditionally, it's always been tough to play here at this level. Dare I say it, Tranmere under Nigel Atkins, eight points off the top seven at the start of play. They're playing a very good side today. It's going to have got monopolised the ball since falling behind. Jody Jones, banging form. And the surge down the left is a good one, and it's headed wide. Well, you'd have put your house on David McGoldrick scoring from there. He scored nine league goals this season. That is a big miss. Rosewell couldn't finish it. They've even sorted their away from them. The first 11 away from Prenton Park. They've won the last two. Things really are looking upwards. Oh, superb manager, manager like this. And that's a good hit from distance. It's spilt wide. It was actually a good stop. Luke McGee got down really well. That was uh, Jody Jones who hit it from about 25 yards. Good palms from McGee. That's going to be beginning to hit the accelerator button at the moment. They're, uh, Really pressing hard for an equaliser. And is it Aidan Baldwin, the big centre back, trying to conduct things as Jones again, heavily involved. That's a wonderfully flighted ball, and the finish is even better. Aaron Namane. And it's a deserved leveller. Two goals in three games for him. Notts County's number 11. Delivered by the number 10. Jones with the assist. That's a belting goal. 1 1. Ascendancy with the visitors. Beaten at Stockport, Harrogate, Wimbledon and Crewe in the last four away games. And today the day they win away from Meadow Lane. That's a beauty! And it's tucked home by guess who? Macaulay Longstaff. 19th league goal of the season for League Two's top marksman. He's at it again. Really good football. Notts County have been the better side ever since they fell behind. This has been coming, great delivery, tucked home by the poacher. Five in three for him post-Christmas. It's 2-1 to the visitors. Longstaff full of confidence. Oh, McGee not certain about that at all. He got away with it. Pies looking the more likely, Longstaff. Starting the 20th of the campaign, I believe. Notts County are always going to give you opportunities, though, of uh, the fourth worst defence in League Two. Joint best attack. Here come Tramia. Good piece of play. Really good delivery, and there's the equaliser. Pretty much right on half time. Connor Jennings, Tramia back level. Lee O'Connor with the cross after good work from uh, Robert Apter. Tramia 2, Notts County 2. Cracking game of Scarlet, 
attacking from both ends. Both sides really going for it. This county do uh, remain entrenched in the playoff places. Four points off the top three, four points clear of eighth. Here come Tramia. They started the second half particularly well, the hosts. Hunting a fifth straight home league win. County starting out again. I think they should have a golden chance of going up. Full of quality. Great delivery. Important header away. Good leap. And upended. Oh, well, well, it's gone uh, Notts County's way. Chance to take the lead. It's Jones. Ever so close. What a footballer Jody Jones is. Oh, whisker away. Victorious over Swindon in the last home game, actually fell behind in that match. Recovered really well. Proper midfield battle. The moment Tramia looking the more tenacious. Here they go, over halfway. A really good surge. And cut in field, that's a lovely ball. And the goalkeeper was there, but it's been turned home. And it's Harvey Saunders. From point blank range, Tramia from 2 1 down, come back to lead Notts County. Harvey Saunders, 11 minutes after the break. Two and three for him. Tramia three, Notts County two. This place is absolutely working. Until one of playing football from the heavens at the moment, Tramia Rovers. They keep going, they will be involved in the playoff picture, that's for sure. It's County, you've got to be careful, they don't fall out of it. Got to sort out their away form in that place. Look at the verve and the panache that Tramia are playing with here. And this is Morris, he comes into the penalty area. Now then, is that a penalty? Referee says yes. Just four minutes after Saunders' goal, Connor Jennings will have the opportunity to put Tramia further clear here at Prenton Park. Clumsy challenge from Bostock, clear penalty. Connor Jennings, you would expect him to score. Up against uh, Aidan Stone, oh, Stone saved it! Incredible goalkeeping. It wasn't a good height for him, but Stone with the incredible reactions. Look at the spring from Stone, that's a great save. Atkins, that is who the red card's gone to. Not happy at all. Atkins is going to sit up in the stands. Goldrick is under pressure, he's lost it. It's been a scintillating Tramia display. They deserve more goals. They might get a fourth here. Now, is that a penalty? It is. And you would imagine it will be over to Connor Jennings. He missed earlier. This to wrap it up in stoppage time. Connor Jennings has the confidence to step up after missing a previous spot kick. It's Jennings down the middle and high into the net. Game set and match, Tramia Rovers. And that's Jennings' second of the afternoon. What an eventful day he's had. He's missed a penalty and he scored a double. A ninth league goal of the season from the spot. Tramia four, Notts County two. Take their race is run. They're going to lose on the road again. It's a fourth straight win for Tramia. They are flying up the table. Do not rule them out of a playoff push. Notts County stay fifth, but they lose serious ground in the top three. There's seven adrift now. Their leaky defence is at it again. Full time. Tramia four. Notts County two.